respective categories. Yesterday, several rounds of interviews were conducted where the candidates shared their knowledge of their supervised agricultural experiences, showed their personal development, expressed future goals, and answered questions from judges to determine the 2023 stars over Iowa. Today's pageant is sponsored by Bex Hybrids. The finalists in the area of agribusiness are. Hi, my name is Jada Thompson and I am a member of the Midland FFA chapter. I process fruits and vegetables to be used in my pie business. I got started in my business because family and friends requested my pies for events, so I decided to open it to the public. My first pie order included 20 pies, while my most recent order included 80 pies and 40 pumpkin rolls. Contributions to my success in this area include taking a food processing class, getting surf safe certified, offering frozen pies, and the purchase of a freezer to sort supplies and pies. My FFA accomplishments include serving as a chapter officer for two years and placing second with my food processing proficiency. After graduation, I plan on attending PCI Ac Academy to earn my cosmetology license. I am the daughter of DJ and Barb Thompson. My chapter advisors are Ms. Jamie Christensen, Mrs. Jen Westfall, and Mrs. Sarah Fishfile. My high school principal is Mrs. Bobby Wilms, and my superintendent is Mr. Caleb Bonder. Your star finalist in the area of agribusiness, please join me in congratulating Jada Thompson. Hello, my name is Abby Gehring and I'm a member of the Williamsburg FFA chapter. My SAE project is Max Boarding, where we board dairy heifers and cows for many people within the show industry. Max Boarding began with the desire to fill the farm with dairy projects and help clients to exhibit the best version of their animals. The business has seen tremendous growth throughout the last four years, from the number of clients and the number of animals boarded to the success seen in the show ring. My success has largely been thanks to my brother, who is my business partner, the support of my family and friends, and of course our clients who provide projects to fill the business. I am currently serving as the Vice President for the Williamsburg FFA Chapter and am the state's first place proficiency award winner in agriculture services. After graduation, I plan to attend Iowa State University, majoring in agricultural education with a minor in dairy science, intending to become an ag teacher and FFA advisor. I am the daughter of John and Lynn Gehring. My chapter advisor is Mrs. Bridget Mahoney. My high school principal is Ms. Linnell O'Connor, and my superintendent is Dr. Chad Garber. Your star finalist in the area of agribusiness, please join me in congratulating Abby Gehring. Hi, my name is Kyle Harold, and I am a member of the West Branch FFA chapter. I run KH Fabrication and I fabricate and design livestock equipment focusing on feed bucket racks for stock show exhibitors and families, as well as gate repair and other welding jobs. I started my welding business in the spring of 2020, welding and designing gates for a show pig barn my family was building. With ideas and help from my mentor Brian Newberger, we designed the bucket racks. It was key to produce and promote a product to appropriately satisfy customers and my business has grown since that time. Keys to success in my project were developing and welding fabrication skills, using critical thinking skills, and communicating with my customers. My significant FFA accomplishments are serving as a Southeast Iowa District Officer for the year of 2022-2023, and I'm currently serving as Chapter President. 
After graduation, I plan to attend Southeast Community College in Milford, Nebraska for diesel ag service technology. I am the son of Scott and Carolyn Harold. My chapter advisor is Mrs. Renee Thompson. My high school principal is Mrs. Sarah Oswald. And my superintendent is Mr. Marty Jimerson. Your star finalist in the area of agribusiness, please join me in congratulating Kyle Harold. Hi, my name is Justin Nearling. I'm the member of the Decor FFA chapter. I'm the owner and operator of Nearling Custom Farming, where I provide producers with services such as round baling and wrapping. In my SAE, I record my total income and expenses within the business. In the summer of 2020, I was looking for something I could do to set myself up for a lifelong career. I was looking at several options and ultimately decided to buy a round baler to work at Star Moon Custom Round Baling business. Throughout the years, my business has grown significantly and I have gained great responsibility and have learned my many life lessons in running a business. I have built 9,600 bales in the lifetime of this business. I expanded services last year and bought a bale wrapper. I wrapped a total of 3,700 bales within the last two years. I recently traded off my baler for a brand new one and bought a bale trailer to rent out to clients to speed up hauling around bales. I have had many people help me get started in custom farming over the years. One of the biggest ways I received clients was through advertising my services on social media and by offering merchandise to the public. In FFA, I have received the gold rating at state with my proficiency. I also served as a committee chairperson in our chapter. After graduation, I plan to slowly start taking over to the family farm. I also plan picking up more crop ground to farm myself and to grow my business and providing producers with more custom services. I am the son of Matt and Jolene Nearling. My chapter advisor is Ms. Joni Bruvold. My high school pr principal is Mr. Brad Hurst, and my superintendent is Dr. Tim Cronin. Your star finalist in the area of agribusiness, please join me in congratulating Justin Nearling. Hi, my name is Eldon Kurt. I'm a member of the Cascade FFA chapter. I run a custom bail wrapping business alongside my brother and sister. I got started in my business by helping my siblings with it, and I eventually bought into the business. Since I started, our business has grown from doing 12,000 to 15,000 bales a year to 16,000 to 20,000 bales a year. Having good customer service and being available to our customers as often as possible has contributed greatly to my success. I am currently serving as chapter president and was the top seller of fruit in our chapter for two consecutive years. After graduation, I plan on attending the University of Wisconsin-Platteville and majoring in agricultural business. I am the son of Jason and Lisa Kurt. My chapter advisor is Mrs. Alicia Smith. My high school principal is Mr. Ryan Fritz. My assistant principal is Mr. Adam Kedley. And my superintendent is Dr. Dan Butler. Your star finalist in the area of agribusiness, please join me in congratulating Eldon Kurt. Hi, my name is Jaden Spear and I am a member of the Algona FFA chapter. I started my own mobile grooming business called Park and Bark. I am fully certified and licensed in the state of Iowa. I became interested in this when I purchased my own indoor dog who needed groomed and I couldn't find a local groomer to get it in in a timely manner. After taking a certification course through Iowa Lakes Community College, I decided a mobile grooming business would work best for me since I was starting my junior year of high school. I drove right up, drive right up to people's houses and groom their dogs in my trailer right in front of their homes. To start, I only did about five dogs a week. I'm currently up to 15 to 20 a week. I have several returning customers and continue to gain new ones. I feel I'm successful in my business since I am mobile. People don't have to take off work and dogs don't have to be kenneled for the rest of the day. In FFA, I earned my Iowa degree and placed second in small animal production and care proficiency. I have also competed on livestock judging teams. After graduation, I plan on going to Iowa Lakes Community College for a degree in business with an agricultural focus. I would like to own my own boarding facility where I can groom from a physical building and continue mobile grooming. I am the daughter of Mark and Mindy Spear. My chapter advisor is Mrs. Betsy Becker. My high school principal is Mr. Jared Cecil and my superintendent, Mr. Joe Carter. Your star finalist in the area of agribusiness, please join me in congratulating Jaden Spear.
your 2023 star in agribusiness. From Decora, Justin Nearling. With over 9,600 bales baled and 3,700 bales wrapped in the history of his business, Justin has, a, has set a great foundation for a lifelong career. Let's congratulate your 2023 star in agribusiness, Justin Nearling. My name is Lauren Cherney, and I'm a member of the Beckman Catholic FFA chapter. I research various issues in agriculture and present my findings to the state and national agri-science fairs. One day will be that farmer, like his grandpa before him, working hard for his family, up early every morning. Ripping up his own John Deere, pouring out his own blood and tears. His future farmers got it in his heart. And his FFA blue jack. Hi, my name is Lauren Cherney, and I'm a member of the Beckman Catholic FFA chapter. I research various issues in agriculture and present my findings to the state and national agri science fairs. I became interested in agri-science through my interest in agriculture and investigation. Through my research, I have learned to use statistical analyses, communicate with others about my findings, and have learned scientific procedures. So far in my project, I've worked with meat, plants, and weed control methods, and my most recent project involves a survey about protein products. My research and the skills I've gained can be used to help producers and consumers develop new ideas to advance agriculture as a whole. My skills gained in research have fostered my passion for my future career pathway in food science. I'm a three-time national finalist in agri-science and was the 2023 Iowa FFA Ag Processing Proficiency winner. I served as the chairperson of our chapter citizenship committee. After graduation in 2023, I plan on attending Iowa State University to major in food science. I'm the daughter of Eric and Jennifer Cherney. My chapter advisor is Ms. Dawn Mauser, and my high school principal is Mr. Marcel Kokutsky. My superintendent is Mrs. Kathy Walls, and my school priest is Father Tyler Raymond. Your star finalists in the area of agri-science, please join me in congratulating Lauren Churn. Hi, my name is Dane Mormon, and I am a member of the South Bryan FFA chapter. My agri-science project was based on determining how different types of drainage tile affect corn yield and moisture content. I became interested in agri-science through various labs and information I learned in my freshman biology class. Growing up on a farm, I used this interest to study crops and how different additives such as tiles change the bushels from the size to the quality. On the surface, I learned that plastic tiles are more efficient for installation because they are cheaper and do the same work that clay tiles do. This project allowed me to study the variants of crop genetics within a particular seed brand. My results have benefited my family's farming operation by showing where to install tiles and what types of seeds to plant every other year. I have served as chapter president and have competed in national soils and meats evaluation competitions. After graduation, I plan to attend Iowa State University to major in actuarial science. I am the son of Josh and Becca Mormond. My chapter advisor is Mr. Eric Cum. My high school principal is Mrs. Denise Phillips, and my superintendent is Mr. Wade Riley. Your star finalist in the area of agri-science, please join me in congratulating Dane Mormond. Your, star, your 2023 star in agri-science, from Beckman Catholic, Lauren Cherney. Lauren is a three-time national finalist in agri-science and has put her number and statistical expertise to work to learn about scientific procedures. From meat, 
plants and weed control methods, Lauren has gained skills to help foster her passion for her future career. Let's congratulate your 2023 star in agri-science, Lauren Cherney, once again. The finalists in the area of ag placement are. Hi, I am Megan Forrett and I am a member of the Kalamazoo Sweetland FFA chapter. My SAE is working for my family owned and operated mowing business, Forrett Mowing. I have invested over 1,890 hours into my supervised agriculture experience. My responsibilities at Forrett Mowing grew tremendously after my father was diagnosed with cancer and passed away in 2019. Currently, I co-manage the mowing of the customer's lawns and also maintain our equipment. I work alongside my mom with the business portion of the company by sending monthly billings, collecting payments, record keeping, and promoting Fort Mowing to gain new customers. I have learned various mental and physical skills, including time management, professionalism, communication, and listening skills that will benefit me in my future career. I am currently serving as the Kalmus Wheatland FFA chapter president and was also part of the nationally qualifying top 16 in the country agriculture issues and perceptions team this past fall. After graduation, I plan on attending Iowa State University to major in elementary education and continue Fort mowing during my summers. I am the daughter of Lori Forrett and the late Chris Forrett. My brother is Brian Forrett. My chapter advisor is Miss Jenna Kingsley. My high school principal is Mrs. Andrea Howard. And my superintendent is Mr. Lonnie Luker. Your star finalist in the area of ag placement, please join me in congratulating Megan Forrett. My name is Trent Nyberg and I'm a member of the Williamsburg FFA chapter. My SEEs are based on my unpaid employment at my family's production strawberry farm, General Bus Farms, and my family's registered goat herd, General Bus Four Goats. I've invested 1,290 hours of employment at General Bus Farms and 1,828 hours on my family's goat herd. My responsibilities include harvesting, marketing, and managing strawberry production within General Bus Farms. For, for General Bus Boar Goats, my responsibilities include herd management, breeding records, and overall care of the animals. The skills of record keeping and customer service that I learned will play a huge role in the advancement of my future career. I'm currently serving as the Williamsburg FA Chapter Treasurer, and I'm the state's first place fruit production proficiency award winner. After graduation, I plan on attending Iowa State University with a major in egg studies with a minor in agronomy. I'm the son of Jason and Angie Eiberg. My chapter advisor is Ms. Bridget Mahoney. My high school principal is Ms. Linnell O'Connor. My superintendent is Dr. Chad Garber. Your star finalist in the area of ag placement, please join me in congratulating Trenton Iberg. Hi, my name is Natalie Burns and I am a member of the Little Switzerland FFA chapter in Wacan. I have productively invested over 2,100 recorded hours milking and monitoring the health of a dairy herd at Prairie Star Farms. At the beginning of my employment, I was tasked with maintaining sanitation as well as milking approximately 125 organic cows. My knowledge of the dairy industry grew immensely along with the success of the operation. 
Soon, a new parlor was being built, and I became involved in the design of structures as well as managing milkings. The operation has now increased to approximately 160 cows using conventional dairy practices. My responsibilities now include managing milking operations, sanitation, basic maintenance, and analyzing herd health to provide quality products to dairy consumers. I have invested in agricultural-based stocks with the money earned to increase my profitability while employed. Throughout the course of my SAE, I have grown in my communication and problem-solving skills that will greatly benefit my future personal and professional endeavors. I am our chapter star in agricultural placement and have received state honors in the agronomy CDE. Following graduation in 2024, I plan to attend an undecided college to major in neuroscience. I am the daughter of Dan and Tracy Burns. My chapter advisor is Ms. Jessica O'Connor. My high school principal is Ms. Jennifer Guerin, and my superintendent is Mr. Jay Mathis. Your star finalist in the area of ag placement, please join me in congratulating Natalie Burns. Hi, my name is Grant Wagner, and I'm a member of the South O'Brien FFA chapter. My SAEs consist of working for my local grocery store, Bob and Scott's, hog chores, and mowing. I have invested 1,091 hours into my projects. My main responsibility at the grocery store is managing the meat counter where I ensure quality meat products are being sold to customers. In addition, I also help with stocking shelves, checking, and carrying out. I have also mowed the O'Brien County Fairgrounds. Throughout my time in FFA, I have served our chapter as Vice President, Parliamentarian, and Reporter. I was the 2019 Reserve Champion Individual in the State Meets Evaluation Contest. After graduation, I plan to attend South Dakota State University to major in music education. I am the son of Tom and Holly Wagner. My chapter advisor is Mr. Eric Kahn. My high school principal is Mrs. Denise Phillips, and my superintendent is Mr. Wade Riley. Your star finalist in the area of ag placement, please join me in congratulating Grant Wagner. Hello, my name is Wilson Deep, and I am a member of the North Scott FFA chapter. My SAE project is my work-based learning experience at John Deere as an IT apprentice, specifically tasked with a database management team maintaining, filtering, and moving data from various sources to our enterprise data lake. I have invested nearly 750 hours and counting in my SAE. My responsibilities include attending meetings, collaborating with members on and off my team, and developing code to maintain the large data infrastructure that fuels the agricultural production industry. I ensure that time-sensitive data, like tractor part delivery dates, arrive in the factories so they can properly plan their work. I've worked with many different types of people with different backgrounds and experiences. The soft and technical skills, along with the knowledge learned, will transfer to my future career as a software engineer. I am currently serving as our chapter's reporter. I have also participated in several competitions and was awarded a gold rating and alternate to districts in the job interview LDE. I participated in the State Envirothon competition last year and was alternate to state for our website design my freshman year. After graduating, I plan on attending Iowa State University for software engineering. I am the son of Fung Deep and Fung Nguyen and brother of Kevin Deep. My chapter advisors are Mr. Jacob Hunter, Ms. Emily Cruz, and Ms. Courtney Wiedemann. My high school principal is Mr. Shane Kanucky, and my superintendent is Mr. Joe Studding. Your star finalist in the area of ag placement, please join me in congratulating Wilson Deep. Hello, my name is Zachary Chambers, and I'm a member of the Charles City FFA. I am employed by Chambers Finishers, and I care for swine that would be sold and processed as pork. I devoted and invested over 2,111 hours into my placement program, which includes two wean to finish facilities and caring for over 10,000 pigs per year. My responsibilities and daily chores include checking the health of pigs, monitoring water consumption, controlling the climate, vaccinating, feed ordering, and keeping accurate records. I plan on working in the production agriculture industry in the future, and my future SAE experiences have helped me meet both skill development and financial goals. The skill areas I have attained are employability skills, handling livestock, and communicating with professionals. I'm currently serving as FFA Chapter President, and I have participated in many career development events the past four years, including ag sales, ag issues, and agronomy. After graduation, I plan on attending North Iowa Area Community College to pursue a two-year degree in agriculture and business, 
and then transferred to Iowa State University to further my education. I am the son of Mark and Ann Chambers. My chapter advisors are Mr. Jim Lumberg and Mr. Brett Spurgeon. My high school principal is Mr. Brian Jurens. My superintendent is Dr. Ann Lundquist. Your star finalist in the area of ag placement, please join me in congratulating Zachary Chambers. Your 2023 star in ag placement from Little Switzerland, Natalie Burns. <laughs> Developing communication and problem solving skills that will greatly benefit in her future plans, Natalie has grown her dairy knowledge greatly with over 2,100 recorded hours of milking and monitoring herd health. Let's give another round of applause to your 2023 star in ag replacement, Natalie Burns. Finalists in the area of egg production are. Hi, I am. Hi, I am Hi. Megan. My name is Hannah Fishwild, and I am a member of the Midland FFA chapter. I own and raise cow calf pairs on my family's century farm. Since an early age, I have always wanted to raise cattle, and I was able to start my cattle operation when I was in second grade with my first heifer. When I was old enough to join 4-H, this also helped me to figure out I had a love for cattle. I have grown my cow-calf operation to 39 cows and heifers. I also have 19 feeder calves and two bulls. I plan to continue the growth of my cow-calf operation throughout college. I currently serve as the Midland FFA Chapter President and am the state first place beef entrepreneur proficiency award winner. After graduation, I plan on attending Iowa State University and major in kinesiology. I am the daughter of Scott and Sarah Fishwild. My chapter advisors are Mrs. Jamie Christensen, Mrs. Jennifer Westfall, and Mrs. Sarah Fishwild. My high school principal is Mrs. Bobby Wilms, and my superintendent is Mr. Caleb Bonger. Your star finalist in the area of egg production, please join me in congratulating Hannah Fishwild. Hi. My name is Ben Roberts, and I'm the member of the Williamsburg FFA chapter. My SAE is raising and selling market beef. My operation started when I bought calves for my dad to feed out and sell. When I started my operation, I had five market calves, and now I'm up to 10. I also have started my own breeding operation to raise registered limousine cattle. In the future, I plan on expanding my herd and start raising registered bulls to sell to commercial and registered breeders. I'm currently serving as a Williamsburg FFA chapter sentinel and was on our chapter state advancing parliamentary procedure team. After our graduation, I plan to continue expanding my herd and work on my family's farm. I'm the son of Todd and Janelle Roberts. My chapter advisor is Mrs. Bridget Mahoney. My high school principal is Ms. Lanella O'Connor. My superintendent is Dr. Chad Garvey. Your star finalist in the area of egg production, please join me in congratulating Ben Roberts. is Elizabeth Heyman and I am a member of the MVAO FFA chapter. My SAE is raising calves from my cow-calf herd that I finish in my feedlot. I also purchase 900-pound cattle that I finish for six months and then sell to packing plants. 
I got interested in raising cattle when I purchased two bottle calves that I raised, which I transitioned into breeding cows. In ninth grade, my SAE scope was three cows, a heifer, and three calves. In December of 2022, I sold 40 fat cattle, which was the most I have ever had at one time. To date, I have sold 87 fat cattle during my SAE. I plan on purchasing more soon and being more consistent with my buying and selling of cattle. I have served as our chapter sentinel for two years. In 2022, I received a gold for the Beef Production Entrepreneurship Proficiency Award. After I graduate, I plan on attending Iowa State University where I will major in business analytics with a minor in animal science and a certificate in beef cattle production management. I am the daughter of Lance and Jana Heyman. My chapter advisor is Mr. John Weimer. My high school principal is Mr. Andrew Armstead, and my superintendent is Mr. Jeff Thielander. Your star finalist in the area of egg production, please join me in congratulating Elizabeth Heyman. Hi, my name is Tara Knapp, and I am the member of a West Line FFA chapter. I raise and milk my own dairy cattle as a portion of nap time dairy. In my labor exchange, I serve as lead evening milker. My SAE started from a gifted calf from my parents. Since then, I have bought and sold multiple heifers, which now brings my productive herd to 15 head of cattle. I plan on continuing to build my herd through college with a continued labor exchange with nap time dairy. I serve as chapter sentinel my junior year and place second gold at state in my dairy entrepreneurship proficiency this year. After graduation, I plan on going to Southeast Technical Institute to double major in diagnostic medical sonography and nursing. I am the daughter of Kevin and Carrie Knapp. My chapter advisors are Ms. Catherine Newhouse and Mrs. Shauna Steiner. My high school principal is Mr. Jug Jaskoot and my superintendent is Mr. Sean Freeman. Your star finalist in the area of egg production, please join me in congratulating Tara Knapp. I am Luke Holgraver from the Northeast FFA chapter in Goose Lake. My SAE began with several bottle calves and feeding them out until market ready. I now have a cow-calf herd where I also finish out the calves. I established a crop share partnership with my sister that began with a few acres of corn and, house, and now has doubled in size to include corn, soybeans, and hay. I also treat my own soybeans before planting. I plan to can you continue to increase my acres farmed and I recently purchased 74 more cows along with four bulls in partnership with my brothers. I'm currently serving as our chapter president and the state winner with my diversified egg production proficiency award and a past winner in grain production and a past runner up in egg mechanics. I will attend Iowa State this fall majoring in egg studies. I am the son of Gary and Lisa Holgraver. My FFA advisors are Ms. Megan Peters and Mr. Joel Frost. My high school principal is Ms. Jennifer Healing, my superintendent and Mr. Neil Gray, who has even ridden in my combine buddy seat as I harvested my own grain. Your 2023 star finalist in the area of egg production, please join me in congratulating Luke Holgraver. Hi, my name is Brady Frost, and I am a member of the Charles City FFA chapter. My SAE program is in production agriculture, where I own and manage a crop and livestock farm. My operation includes a 22 head cow-calf herd, and I am involved in the family's 500 head and cattle feeding operation. I also raise and show market hogs. I have purchased a 25 acre farm, and I rent an additional 80 acres for my corn and soybean production. I help in my family's crop operation. My short term plans are to expand my SAE program by building another calving barn, and I have recently made a large investment in my new drone pesticide application business. My long-term plans include purchasing and renting more farm ground, expanding my cattle operation, and to grow my drone application business. Throughout my years in FFA, I have served as a chapter, chapter secretary and president. I received first place in the Iowa Proficiency Award for beef production in 2022. I have exhibited FFA livestock at the county fair and Iowa State Fair. I am a son of Rod and Amy Frost. My chapter advisors are Mr. Jim Lumberg and Mr. Brett Spurgeon. My high school principal was Mr. Brian Jerns. 
your 2023 star finalist in the area of egg production. Please join me in congratulating Brady Frost. Your star in ag production from Charles City, Brady Frost. From cattle to hogs and corn to soybeans, Brady owns and manages a crop and livestock farm. He has gained many skills and received the 2022 Beef Production Proficiency Award. Let's give another round of applause to all the 2023 stars over Iowa. On behalf of the Iowa FFA Association, I would like to thank Bex Hybrids for their support of the Stars Over Iowa program. Please receive this conference gift as a token of our appreciation. Let's give them a round of applause. <laughs> 